A Chinese company says it gave its employees experimental coronavirus vaccine shots even before the government approved testing in people. In an online post, state-owned Sinopharm called it a pretest and said the workers were helping to forge the sword of victory. Their claim illustrates the enormous stakes for China in the global race for a vaccine to end the pandemic. They want to uh, be the first to develop a, a new vaccine for COVID, you know, to instill a sense of national pride, you know, to uh, boost the regime legitimacy. China is competing against U.S. and British companies and accounts for eight potential vaccines being tested, the most of any single country. Sinopharm's two vaccine candidates are among the country's leading contenders. Their claim that 30 workers rolled up their sleeves before authorities granted permission for the human tests raises ethical concerns. Sinopharm declined to comment for this story. If there are concerns about the ethics of a vaccine um, development, uh, people may be frightened to take it, whether it's safe or not. The early testing also raises questions about whether employees felt pressure to participate. If you, according to the Chinese cultural, right, uh, only prized yourself, your individual interests of the group interests, you are, this is considered sort of like a dishonor. Scientists abroad are closely watching China's vaccine research. Compared to leading candidates in the West, several Chinese candidates, including Sinopharms, rely on a more tried-and-true technology. It involves growing the entire virus in a lab and then killing it, much like how flu shots are made. Some of China's shots already are moving into final stages of testing. Sam McNeil, Associated Press, Beijing.